In this video, we are going to have some fun Friday! Fun pumpkin Friday. We're going to celebrate a little bit of the Thanksgiving season. Almost my birthday, one more month. It's almost her birthday, and how old are you going to turn? Eight. I don't know how I, if I'm gonna be able to handle this. So come along with us as we play with some pumpkins, make some pumpkin slime, pumpkin volcanoes. Who knows what else is gonna happen today, but. Painting a picture of a pumpkin? Yes, that is a great idea. I was thinking of that as well. Like the Perfect. wood, remember I painted the cross? Yeah, or you could just paint on paper. My name is Kristen and this is Zoe. Welcome to my channel, Fearlessly Loved, where I talk about all things homeschooling, family, and faith, and where I hope to be an encouragement here for you, whether you are homeschooling or not, or curious about it. I hope to breathe some life into your day today. <laughs> if you enjoy this video, you can go ahead and place a comment below. You can go ahead and subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon to let you know when new content is and coming out. Big thumbs up. A big and thumbs up, that's right. Sometimes um, when people ask me how my day is, I just do like this. Cause I'm just like, so tired. tired. Yeah, that's like, oh, it's all right. Well, no, like almost at the top. Uh, like this is good and this is mm. awesome. Mm. Sick. Oh, yikes. Tired. We have a couple of these days this week. <laughs> Not so good. But today is going to be a good day. We're going to make that declaration in our homeschool today. It's been a little bit challenging. So that is why we are moving forward with a fun Friday. Wait, it's Friday? I thought it was Thursday. Definitely Friday. Oh. <laughs> but first, we have to go to the store to pick up some pumpkins and a couple other supplies that we need for some experiments and other things. So we will catch you back later. Bye. Well, not for now. Till we get the pumpkins. We'll be back. All right, we're back from the store. It took so a long time. this goes to show how crazy of a week it was. We did not find pumpkins, right? So, dun, 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 dun. it turned into butternut squash day. We're changing, we're switching it up. We went from pumpkin day to butternut squash it's fun. Friday fun day, but it's all good. So first things first, we're going to make a butternut squash volcano. We went to Walmart, we went to Aldi, and then we went to ShopRite. Ay ay ay! But it's all good. We're back and we're ready to roll. So we're going to start out with our butternut squash. This is the part that I'm going to do because this is not going to be easy. Kids, don't try this at home. You press record. All right, we're almost there. Oh, that's how you do. All right, seeds. what do we see in there? Oh, the seeds. The parts of the coconut. And it smells good. What does it, it smell like? Does it smell like a pumpkin? Mm-hmm. Mm. It sounds like jack o -lantern. So now the fun part. We get to stick our hands in there and pull Ew. out. Pull it all out. I remember doing that at my preschool, making a jack o' lantern. Go ahead. Ew. We get to examine. There's spiders in it. There's no spiders in there. I don't like spiders. It looks like. Ew. So what do you think these are? Um, seeds? Yeah, those are the seeds. You could actually roast them. Really? We can try roasting them. Do you want to eat them? Yeah, we could try it. Oh, see what they taste cool. like. I, I didn't know I could eat them. Look at all that <laughs> butternut squash goodness. <laughs> <laughs> so first we're going to examine the parts of a butternut squash, which are oh, very similar to a pumpkin. So the orange part is the, called the flesh, right? This is the skin. So you see this part? This yeah, is called the fibrous, oh, yeah. fibrous strands. And then the ooey gooey stuff are the seeds. But then the ooey gooey stuff that's really slimy, like this part? that's called the pulp. Yep. Ew, I'm a slime. Mm -hmm. What does it look like under your magnifying glass? What do you see? 
the strands. It looks like corn hair. <laughs> Does it feel neat? It actually feels like real slime, but it's like I put seeds in my slime. Okay, so now we are going to get all our ingredients for the volcano. We have white vinegar. We have some dish soap. <coughs> what we and, used for the dishwasher. Yep, what we used to wash the dishes. We have the some... The hard food coloring to put in the... Yep, what colors do we have? Squash. We want it to look orange, right? So what colors do we Yellow have? Yellow and red. Yellow and red make orange. What else do we have? Oh, we have baking soda. Okay, so you want to pour in a quarter cup of baking soda. There's your quarter it's cup. It's going to be dirty. Yeah. Well, it's getting sugary. Okay, that's about a quarter cup. Did I put all of it in? Mm-hmm. Put it in there. You're gonna add a squirt of dish soap. Yeah, this is this can pour. So I'm gonna have to. So the careful. dish soap creates a foamier eruption. What's a foamier eruption? So foamy is, uh, is that good? when you have lots of bubbles. I don't know what it. That's good. It's gonna produce more bubbles <laughs> and more of a dramatic <laughs> eruption that we're looking for. All right, so now add a few drops of food coloring. I, which one was hard? Three. Okay. Oh, mm -hmm. this one's not hard. The other ones are hard. I was wrong. Okay, so with the vinegar and the baking soda, Whoa. we're going to be doing some... Mixing. This is This is a little chemistry experiment. So when we... Mix baking soda and vinegar together, that's what makes, it makes a reaction for, to release carbon dioxide. All right, so go ahead and pour it in. that we're using for this slime are some good old H2O and some liquid starch Isn't purchased that from Walmart some clear glue I think that was from Walmart too and that's about it for this recipe oh baking soda yeah that was yeah baking soda you have to put baking soda I don't this mess this um Recipe does not call for baking soda. What? Slime no. has always been Well, because we're soda. using liquid starch. You measure out a half a cup what is of water. So, where does it say one half? You see one oh, half? Yeah. That's one half. Right there. Good job. So, that's one half. Okay. All right. Then you're going to add another half um. a cup. Clear glue. clear glue. So, one half plus one half equals? Um, that. One whole. So one. So you pour this until it says one. 
to where it says oh, one. Oh, here? Yes. To make it all gooey. Almost. All right, that's good. Awesome. Cool. Whoa, you can see like the little, they look like spider webs. So gooey and heavy. Now we're going to use one quarter cup of liquid starch. Oh, it's a little clear actually. Mm -hmm. See how much you can get. We might have to transfer it into a bowl, but that's okay. Ready? So we're going to... Oh! There you go. Looks like boogers. I think it is boogers. I think you just tricked me. Ew. Get your hands in there. <laughs> do you want to play with it too? Well, you do it first. Look, this is big boogers. So big. Slimy. That's how slime works sometimes. Only when you make slime at home, it's so slimy. But there's like professional people that make slime at factories to go to the stores, and it's not really that slimy. What happened to our slime? Nothing's happening. I don't know what happened to the other slime, but I made a whole new batch of slime, regular slime without the pumpkin, and then I just added the pumpkin slime into the regular slime, and now we got some better slime. Yeah, the Facebook link or Instagram. Ooh. Best idea ever for today. Hey, you all slimed out? Yeah. We are still slime. We have some ginger, some cinnamon, and some clove. So pick one. Cinnamon. Half teaspoon of clove. So grab your teaspoon. Yeah, that's a teaspoon. I'll pour it. <laughs> Doesn't have to be perfect. That's a lot of cloves. I'm going to dump some out of there. You want to pour it? Ah, uh, you got to you gotta like smush it. See? Okay. Sure. Then we need one teaspoon of cinnamon. Not too much. Uh, yes. Oh. There's one teaspoon. I just want to eat it. Well, you can actually, but you have to mix it with something like oatmeal. I love oatmeal. All right, grab the salt. Where's the salt? That big oh, yeah. cylinder. We need half a teaspoon of salt. Oh, yeah. Yep, there you go. It looks like snow. Mix, mix, mix. Whoa. There's not really a lot of things in here. The thing that we, this is gross. Do you guys want to smell it again? I mean, that's so gross. I don't even know if I want to taste apple pie. I mean, not apple pie. Except our eggs. Two eggs. So you're going to put the eggs in the green bowl. <coughs> Two eggs in the green bowl. I've been cracking in since I was like, I don't know, four. Go ahead. No, it hurts. There you oh. go. Good job. No shells in there. Good. So the disgusting part about shells, it's like too crunchy for you. All right, next one. 
I hope there's a chicky in this one. <laughs> <laughs> I hope there's not a chicky in that one. Why? There you go. Wait, the most thing you have to do is chop it. One day I made pancakes all by myself. Like, all by myself. Like, my, I don't even know if you guys even helped me. You didn't even help me. Well, Natty didn't even help me. There's another little spatula, too. Ew. Woo. <laughs> this is the, the pumpkin's pool. They're going to swim in. Do you want to hold the camera? Yeah, sure. All right, get that mixed up. Ew. Mmm, ah. smells even better. All right, while you're at it, throw in the dry ingredients. better if we used a whisk. Yep, go ahead and add the sweetened condensed milk. Whoa. Ooh. It's like making like steps. All right, we have our pumpkin pie mixture and now we have to put a piece of pie crust <laughs> in the pie dish. Oh, look, look at the, look at the guy. I'm like a little scissor. I can like easily Oh, cool. Wait, is this dough? Mm-hmm. Oh, that's so cool. Here we go. Oh, that is so much. All right, you want to see the pumpkin pie? Yeah, well, I already Got some squash in there and pumpkin pie. What do you think? It's hot. I can't really smell it. I colored it with food coloring. Look at that. <laughs> it worked out. It's not really that sticky anymore. I add some of that. <laughs> Let me see. Good. Dickly, dickly. <laughs> <laughs> Will it color this? It's fine. I'm gonna make a human heartbeat. Smile at me. Whoa. All right, we're gonna try the squash first. You're just eating the butter and the maple syrup. Ew, Zoe. Your seeds. All right, let's try the squash, ready? You like it? Mm hmm My tasting buds say yes. Wait, what are the they called? Tasting buds say yes? Mm hmm Nom, nom. Yum. thing that that I hated to smell I don't know why it doesn't flavor in here ginger 
I like to spread it. <laughs> I hope you enjoy this video. Bye!